What is up guys and welcome back to Power Metal Gamer. So today we're going to do a very special video. And if you guys can remember Franchise from the show, he sent me links recently to this really, really cool front end thing for your PC, which is for arcade games. So basically it's all categorizes all your arcade games and it emulates arcade games on MAME. But the whole layout is just absolutely fantastic. He downloaded it from some site called Arcade Punks, I think it's called. And uh, I will leave all the links in the description down below. You can download it for your PC and it's really, really cool. So I downloaded the arcade version, which is around 17 gigs. And all of the games that come on it are absolutely fantastic. And I just love the layout of this thing itself. So. As I said before, I don't really regularly do videos here on the channel anymore. But um, I took out the green screen and all of the, the stuff so you get a bit of visual... Something visually nice to watch. Anyways guys, so um, without further ado, let's get this on and have a look at this Coin Ops Arcade Edition. And see what's on there. So guys, here we are on the menu of uh, Coin Ops Next Arcade. And uh, we're going to go through the games to see what's here. So the first game on it is 10 Yard Fight. We've got 1941 by Capcom. It's a shmup or shoot them up as, as you call them. We've got 1942, 1943, 1943 something blah in Japanese. Uh, 1944, 1945K, it's a shitload of games. So out of the box, it, it's compatible with your Xbox One controller. If you've got one or if you have any good PC controllers, that they, they'd work fine as well. But uh, I'd, I'd love to actually have an arcade stick. So I'm going to look into getting an X arcade stick for, for, this, um, for this front end. It's really cool. So we got Super Baseball, Body Count, 64th Street, 120, Act Fencer. And you can easily get through um, from A to Z by pressing or B. Look at all the mad games on here. We got like bad dudes. So you can get through here. So many great games. Darius. We got Dark Seal, Dark Stalkers, Night Stalkers. Uh, what's it? Night the Night Warriors is the second Dark Stalkers game. Uh, we got Dead Connection, Dead Smiles, The Deep Defender. And plus also also there's a lot of things if you press left and right on it, you get your arcade classics. So they're all categorized into certain things. So you got all the 1942s, you got Afterborn, you got Alien Storm, you got Alien Syndrome, um, Altered Beast, uh, Arachnoid 2, Armored Warriors, Asteroids, Avengers. It just the list goes on. So if you got to cross again, we go for old school. It's got Afterburner and it's got some of the same games in each thing. So. You got a lot of beat em ups as well. You got um, B Rap Boys, Battle Toads, Blade Master. There's a game I recently discovered called. Um, what was it? Violent Storm? I've never even heard of it or played it. Like, I played it like recently. And we got Golden Axe. We got Golden Axe Revenge of Death Adder. Fantastic game if you guys haven't played that already. Uh, it's got The King of Dragons. It's got Knights of the Round. What's that? Uh, Knights of Valor, Knights of Valor 2, and there was another game I recently played. Uh, what was it called? You got Michael Jackson's Moonwalker. What's that game I played recently? It's called. Um, I'll find it now. You got Ninja Warriors, Ninja Gaiden, uh, Ninja Baseball Batman, which is really really fun. I can't remember the name of the game. That I was saying Goku Tree I played recently. There's three of them. Really, really good fighting game. Well, beat them up. But and there's, they're, they're, it's incredibly hard. So you're going to be eating a lot of coins playing these games. Um, obviously, you got infinite coins by pressing the back button or the options button. I think it's on the Xbox One. Um, you basically can put coins in the system. You got Turtles, Turtles in Time, Two Crew Dudes, Undercover Cop. So I'm going to have a go at... Voiland Storm and show you guys what this is like. I gotta run about two or three games to um, show you how this emulator runs. It's fantastic. It's really, really good. So, doing a ROM, RAM, ROM check. 
Voiland Storm. It takes a couple of seconds to actually boot up, as an arcade machine usually does. So, Voiland Storm 1993, so the 30th of August. Really, really awesome game. So his girlfriend gets captured and he has to go rescue her or something like that by these bad dudes. So I'm gonna throw in a couple of coins. Konami beat em ups back in the 90s were fucking amazing if you guys haven't played any of them. I think everyone has. Any old school gamer has always has played some sort of Konami beat em up Simpsons, Turtles. Amazing. So I'm gonna pick Wade. Music's really good as well. I really dig this game. They just fucked up their lovely car. So, you get your jump, you get your hit button, and I don't know what that. He's a madman! So you get your low attacks as well, so if you press down and punch and up and punch, you do all the gopher clips and shit like that. Really cool. I think I need to do a bit of tweaking because I see a bit of screen tear or something up the top. But uh, it's very easily fixable. The music. <laughs> it's really cool. You're stabbing people. I love how big the character sprites are. Really, really cool. You stab that guy in the face. He's a madman. So, guys, you get the gist of what this game is, and it's really fun. The bosses are very creative as well. I wonder why they never did a Voiland Storm 2. I should really look it up. I never even heard about the game until I played this um, arcade. It's really cool. If you're fans of like you know Streets of Rage or uh, Final Fight or something like that, then you you will definitely like this game. Oh, now I'm just addicted to it. I'm just <laughs> so okay. I gotta go back to the menu. So start and back gets you to the menu. So guys, that was Violent Storm, a really, really good game. I have never even heard of it or played it until recently when I got this um, this front end from a computer. Really, really cool. cool. Um, any kind of beat em ups like Streets of Rage or something like that, it, it really has my attention. So uh, we got Warrior Blade, we got Warriors of Fate, Boilfang X-Men Arcade, also another Konami classic. And I, I love the, the, the artwork behind all of these pictures, it's really cool as well. So, like Alien Storm and a AVP and Armored Warriors. So we're gonna go across next to Run and Gun. Uh, what have we got here? We got Desert Breaker, we got Dragon Buster. There was a game on the PS1 I talked about recently. Uh, oh yeah, the sequel to this was in my PS1 uh, top five um, Namco games. Really, really good. I've never played the original Dragon Buster, as I said in that video as well. So, uh, Elevator Action Returns. Look at that cleavage. Uh, Cyber Police Eastwatt. Sega game, I think, isn't it? Yeah, it's Sega. Um, ga Gangbusters, Ghosts and Goblins, Ghouls and Ghosts, Green Beret. So many fucking amazing games here. Hammer and Harry. And then we got the, the Foy Club. We got uh, We got... Power Wrestling, Fatal Fury, Fatal Fury Special, Final Round, um, Golden Axe The Jewel, which is really, really good, Hippodrome, um, Hyper Street Fighter 2, JoJo's Bizarre Adventure, JoJo's Venture. Wow, this, the list just goes on. We got Killer Instinct, we got Killer Instinct 2, which is also called Killer Instinct Gold on the N64, uh, King of Fighters, all, all the King of Fighters. Uh, King of the Monsters 2. I don't know what King of the Monsters 1 is on here. Strange. So no, it's an okay game. Last Blade, Main Event, Marvel Super Heroes, Street Fighter, Capcom vs. Marvel, Mortal Kombat 1, 2, 3, Pit Fighter, Punch Out. Pretty sure Tekken's on here as well, and Soul Calibur. Samurai Showdowns there. There's Soul Calibur. All the Street Fighters. Look, look at all the Alphas and. 
Street Fighter 3. Just there's so many Street Fighter the movie, the EX series. Seriously, guys, get your ass on this. Download it. I'll leave the link in the description and everything else you'll need. You'll need something to extract the foils, like so, WinRAR, something like that. Vampire Savior, which is Darkstalkers. Um, so let's let's check out the other lists. We got the shoot 'em ups, the shmups, all the 1941s, the uh, the Viper. Many of Viewpoint, Vizara, Varth, UN Squadron. I know Johnny Millennium is a huge fan of the, the UN Squadron games. Um, Twin Cobra. Twin B? What the hell's that? We got Truxton 1 and 2. What else we got? Jesus, this it's it's literally got everything you can you can think of. Um then you got your race driver games. So Badland, Chase Head Q, Cruising USA is really good. Um, you got Hang On, Hard Driven, Lucky and Wild, whatever that is. Outrun. That was really fun, I liked Outrun. Oh, there's so many. Then you got your 3D games, Afterburner, Alien 3, The Gun. I wish the G Con or we had some sort of um, light gun that was compatible with like, computer screens. I'm using obviously flat screens. The time crisis is on here as well. We got Jurassic Park, the game. Um, what else we got? We got Ridge Racer one and two. Roll Blasters, Raid Rave Racers on there. Um, Space Harrier. We got the original Star Wars game from the arcade. Uh, Star Blade, Steel Gunner. Wow, there's just so many. Time Crisis looks amazing. Alien Tree the Gun. Just, just, just so many. And then you got your sports games, you got your Atari classics, uh, you got all your Capcom games thrown into like a list. Um, cave classics? Like, I don't know what that is. So, yeah, you got your Konami, Midway, Namco, Neo Geo. You got all your Nintendo games like Donkey Kong being there, uh, Taito. Just, just so many so I'm gonna stick on maybe one more game and just show you guys what it is all about now if you want to leave a comment down below in this video and just if you want to see like a gameplay video or something um, while I talk through it and you know show you what it's like uh, I see how good I am actually at arcade games leave a comment down below let me know what games you're interested in seeing because I can do that, it's easy enough, I just pop a game on, press record and there we go, Bob's your uncle, Mary's your auntie. Um, so what we, what we stick on for a go? We'll stick on, um, we stick on aliens. So we'll have to go all the way back up to A. So, 57 years later! We're just gonna slap in those coins there. So, Aliens 1986 came out in, and the game came out in 1990. And it's also Konami. So, that's a good thing. That's a good thing. That's a good thing. So, put in some coins. Press start. Abandoned space settlement on L426 Acheron. Scenario Special Marine Task Force has just landed, and Nightmare is just about to begin again. Hunt down and destroy the aliens. And if you can, keep yourself alive long enough. So, yeah, it's one of these games. <laughs> Take that alien scum! I remember there's like a lot of really weird aliens that weren't even in the movie. Like, created specifically for this game. And the boss is like, uh, there's an alien called Ripclaw, or he's got like some sort of mad claw. Really strange looking alien. I think he's like the first boss in it. Oh, was that AVP? I can't, I can't really remember. I remember this game is really fun, though. Come on, get some of that alien balls! Did I do a video on this before? Fuck off, facehugger bastards. Look at this state of this guy. Oh! Never seen you. Ooh! <laughs> Got some grenades in the face. Oh, oh! 
All right, I've got infinite coins. Oh yeah, you can you can hold the button to automatically shoot. <laughs> I'm just tapping it like a fucking idiot. Shoot him in the face. His penis head. Ah! <laughs> What's the little? Oh, this, he's got two tiny bits. Oh shit! He's flipping out. Hey, where are you going with a head like that? Oh! I'm dead! Come on, get me back in there! He's not dead yet! Shoot him in this hole in his face! Come on, get him! Get, get him! Get him! <laughs> I'm terrible at this game. Can you imagine the money that this would have sucked out your ass back in the day? Jump into that. Give me a shot. Come on! Oh shit! Get, get off! You failures! Oh, now you can't hold your finger on the button, you have to keep pressing it. Shit! Ah, no! <laughs> but uh, guys, I think you actually get the gist of how this amazing uh, front end works. Um, I'm gonna play some more of this. And uh, uh, if you like this video, please drop a, a comment below, like the video, and subscribe if you haven't already. And uh, if you want further notifications on when I upload new videos to Power Metal Gamer, be sure to click that little notification bell down below. And um, I will catch you later on, on Power Metal Gamer. As always, keep the power. Okay, take 15 or something like that. I don't know. I'm losing track with the fucking noise next door. They're drilling and they're banging. So, uh, yeah, take 15 or I don't know, whatever. Anyways, let's get the video on. And hopefully there's no disturbances. <laughs> so here I am trying to shoot a fucking video. And every couple of minutes you hear a drill or a banging next door. There we go again. I'm losing my fucking mind. Shut the fuck up with your drilling and your hammering. You had all day to fucking do and it's like what seven o'clock now, Jesus Christ. Look, it's getting louder. It's right at that wall there behind the shelf. It's it's every couple of minutes like get the job done now and fucking get it over with and be waiting about an hour now to record a fucking video jesus <laughs>